What up, Laker Nation? You have your boy Kareem, aka Mr. Hundred Likes. How you guys doing? Wow. Let's get to it. Let's get to it, man. What game six of um the Bucks and Milwaukee series showed you guys? Show Lakers management that you cannot build around LeBron James. Because normally LeBron James teams with guys who this this spot up, LeBron got the ball spot up and kick out. And basically guys who just basically stand uh, stationary, either in the corner or the wings or top of the key and shoot three-point shots. You cannot do it. Um, it showed you what good defense uh, could do and collapse on you if they um, play good defense on the star player. Now, I said that because Giannis uh, has that type of team that LeBron had in the past where them guys just, Giannis get the ball and they and kick out and them guys stand there and shoot. But the major, major difference is the Lakers got to get in reality. LeBron is not the player he used to be. So if Giannis, he's he's not um, better than Giannis, and Giannis right now is a, is a much better player than LeBron. So with that being said, it's hard on Giannis, even though LeBron has a better jump shot than Giannis. You just can't build the team that way. So I hope the Lakers do not go into it and say, hey, we're going to build the team around LeBron James. LeBron James can adapt to uh, any system. He's uh, 38, well, will be 38, and um, he could uh, change a little. You don't want to build around him. Let LeBron fit in whatever system you're going to bring. Bring players that can get their own shot, who can play defense, athletic, um, guys, you know, jumping could be decent, but guys who could get their own shot. That's the way to build the team because when that defense clamp and if guys missing their shots, they nothing. That's the scary part about Milwaukee right now. If them guys don't hit their shots, they don't got a chance in hell of winning. And they don't got a ch chance in hell to get um, get themselves going. Because normally when people get themselves going, good players, great players, when they jump and not falling, they drive to the basket, get fouled, and, and work their way, you know, into an offensive rhythm. When guys who just stand still shooting, when they jump shot not falling, they this bad all the way through. So, and like I said, Le LeBron is not the player he used to be, number one. Number two, the NBA changed. And um, where you got guys now, where you got a bunch of wings that's, you know, defending the perimeter, so it makes it that much harder. It's different from back in the days where you had slower guys. Now guys can get to out get to them shooters, and them shooters can't put the ball on the floor. It makes it difficult. The Lakers must know that LeBron James is a great player, and he can adapt to uh, multiple uh, systems. And they can't just say, oh, we're building a team around him. You just can't now do it. Just build a good team and let them figure it out later. Like, subscribe, peace.